In this video, you will learn how to use board views. Board views offer Trello Premium and Enterprise users more ways to visualize their work and dashboards. Let's start with the table view. Table view allows you to see a board's cards in a compact, manageable table format. To access the table view and any of the other board views, make sure the board is on a premium or enterprise workspace. Start by selecting the view switcher. Then select table. You can select the different fields on the table to interact with the cards. This lets you change the list, labels, members, and due date, and also add new cards directly from this view. Select Filter to refine your view even more. For example, if this bakery wanted to see all their overdue orders across all carts, they could select Overdue under Due Date. For a new perspective on what's going on in your board, try the Dashboard view. Select Dashboard from the View Switcher. By default, the dashboard will include a few tiles for you to get started. Cards per list helps you see how work is progressing. Cards per member shows you how work is distributed on your team. Insights like these can help you manage progress and roadblocks more effectively. You can add, edit, or delete tiles to create a dashboard that works for you and your team. Select the menu icon in the top right corner of the tile to edit or delete it. Editing a tile allows you to switch between different charts and graphs. Add a tile by selecting the plus icon at the bottom of the dashboard. Select your chart type. Then, select a dashboard type. Select Add Tile. The Timeline view offers you a different way to see how your team's work fits together. It also allows you to map out your projects and help your team meet their deadlines. Select Timeline from the View Switcher. Navigate through the timeline with the header controls at the top or scroll through the timeline with your mouse. You can also select the Today button if you ever get lost. Adjust card dates by selecting and dragging the handles on the edge of the cards. Or select and drag the entire card. Select the Group By dropdown to change the timeline perspective. Add new cards or list by selecting the Add button on the bottom left corner. The calendar view offers another way to visualize your board's start dates and due dates. Select calendar view from the view switcher. Select the buttons at the top to adjust the scope of your calendar view. Drag and drop cards to keep your calendar organized. Due dates will automatically be adjusted. You can also select and drag the edges of a card to adjust the start and due dates. Select a card to edit it directly. Select Add at the bottom left corner to add a new card. Map View allows you to see the location of all your board's cards on a map, helping you see where work gets done. First, cards need a location to be placed on the map. Open a card and select the Location button on the card back. Type in the address or location. The location will now appear on the card. 
Now, let's select Map from the View Switcher. In this example, Sunshine Cakery can see all the cards with delivery locations on the map. Select a marker on the map to see the card in that location. Select the card to edit it. Add a new card by selecting Add a card in the top right corner. Or double-click anywhere on the map to add a card.